Good evening. And I have one question. Have you, oh, uh, if any one of you has been to the international message board like MyGet, Reddit, or Fortune? No? None of you? Good, because you are not the professional otaku like me. I do. But today, I'm going to show you a very popular um, internet phrase on the online website. It's called pictures or it didn't happen. What is the, uh, how, does, how do you use it? For example, if one friend told us was showing up on Facebook and telling you that he just got a beautiful girl's phone number, you can, can you doubt it? You can just leave a message like, hey, show me pictures, or I don't believe it happened before. So in Taiwan, uh, we just have the same sentence. I always wonder how to love using this phrase. But after one day I took a workshop about photo editing, I found a very powerful magic we can easily break this sentence. That is the Adobe Photoshop. Um, this, uh, the Photoshop is one of the most popular software for photo editing. And today I invite the professor name <laughs> to show us uh, how to transform the face within simple three cells. The cell one is to adjust the brightness. Light is the soul of the pictures. And in Photoshop, you can uh, you can find this curve diagram on the right side. And uh, actually, the pattern means um, how to the uh, how the light distributes in this picture. And when we drag the uh, when we drag the curve upside, uh, which means we can enlighten the whole shadow on the face. So it's brighter, right? Yeah. And let's go to the cell two. Um, retouch the skin. Retouch means uh, you have to retouch your yeah. skin. <laughs> <laughs> and we have two very useful tools. One is the killing brush, and the second is stamps. You can just apply them, uh, apply them to every word, like the wrinkles, like the black circles uh, after a midterm, or the pores you want to hide on your face. Yeah, just simply draw it, and we'll see all the wrinkles, oh. the, the things that the defects are gone. And the third, here is the, three, uh, the third cell, this is the surgery. <laughs> the plastic surgery in a real life, you know, is very dangerous and expensive, but even it's a software. So it's easy and safe. Uh, just find the liquid, uh, liquefied button on the toolbar, and then you can enlarge the eye. <laughs> you can sharpen the chin, uh, the chin, or even change the shape of your nose. And that is the new face. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, guys. And now let's compare it. <laughs> we, we just use simple three steps, right? And we can change a man into a totally flower boy. Look <laughs> <laughs> at the novice. And for those uh, veterans, they can have more magic, uh, they have more powerful skills to do with Photoshop. And that's why my trust in beautiful photos collapsed on the day I learned Photoshop. And I, I also believe that this term will be changing into pictures, but nothing real happens. <laughs> So nowadays, more and more people are aware of the danger of Photoshop, and in Israel, they even uh, create a law to uh, to uh, to force every picture to after the Photoshop they should mark it. And but some people defend that Photoshop is just a way to achieve perfection. And if a painter can choose how to draw, why can't a photographer choose how to show the photo and how to revise them? And one of the uh, American uh, photographer says so. The photography is not real at all. It's just the illusion uh, of reality with which we create our own world. Just illusion. So if we have the freedom to revise it as much as possible. And if that's the truth, actually we need to, uh, when we are take, uh, viewing those photographs, we need critical thinking. And when it comes to, uh, we have to do some post-production on our own photos. We need some guidance. So here I have two theories. From uh, they are actually the inscriptions on the upon the temple of Apollo. The theory one: know yourself. This uh, I have a case from a Korea, uh, Korean beauty contest. Many one of uh, my, many of you might see this article before. You can see that the photos of these contestants are so sim similar, and there's even a, a bad guy created this action figure. Oh. <laughs> Group of um, clone army. 